I am Gretchen Etheridge and I'm the director of Highland Counseling Center as well as the marriage minister at Highland Church of Christ. As a non-traditional student at ACU's MFT program, I had to go into it knowing that um, perhaps it had been a while since I had you know, written papers or read huge books <laughs> and had to, to recall the information. Uh, but I also did find, especially once I was in it, that my life experience helped me to grasp a lot of those concepts a lot faster. Other challenges as far as maybe, you know, financially, not having my income in our household while I was in school, that was something that we had to know as a family and know that, uh, that it was going to be worth that sacrifice, and it, and it was, uh, but just being prepared. We weren't, uh, we weren't kind of caught off guard by that. Um, and, you know, we made new friends in the cohort too, even though we were older. I think our experience and our age and our family was very important to our cohort. So maybe we weren't doing things all the time because that, that would have been a little bit strange because there was a gap in age, but, uh, but we did. And I, I'm still good friends with many people that I was in the cohort with. The MFT program at ACU, it helped me not only whenever I was in the program, but it has helped me uh, since graduating. Um, I would have, if you would have said, Gretchen, one day you're going to be the director of a counseling center and you're going to be a minister. I would have said, no, that's not going to happen. So I really just felt like I would go in, I would be a counselor, that would be the job I would have for the rest of my life because that just sounded like the most amazing thing ever. Um, and I do love it, but doors, doors were opened to do some of these other things. In order to walk through those doors, I needed support, again, from the uh, MFT program at ACU. So I received um, opportunities as I was getting my uh, becoming a supervisor. Uh, I went there and they provided an opportunity for me to supervise interns while I was working on that, as well as providing uh, the mentorship in order for me to do that. And then as a director needing interns, they said, hey, we'll work with you and provide some interns that would be a good fit for you. So it's, it's an ongoing relationship. So I think just very holistic. I think it's mind, body, spirit in the program with a cohort, with faculty, with supervisors, with an internship that grows you, grooms you. I guess there's lots of things I would say, but I'd say that's how it helped me to do what I'm doing now, which I love. <laughs>